Welcome back to Smart Money Monday. Today, we're going to learn how a 401k can help you save money for your retirement. And here to discuss all things 401k is Chris Otto from Banco Investment Services. Aloha, Chris. Hey, aloha, Steve. So, so why are 401k so popular, Chris? You know, it really comes down to two things, Steve. It's ease and tax benefits. It's really easy because it's automated, which essentially forces us to pay ourselves first. So if you think about it, when you enroll in your 401k plan as an employee, you just have to decide how much money you want to set aside for your retirement. Once you set up that election, your your employer will deposit that money automatically each paycheck directly into your 401k plan. I, I like that. Pay yourself first. You know, it's such an important concept, you know, and most of us forget about that because the reality is that, uh, you know, we work every day. We work hard just to maintain our same standard of living daily in and out. And we often put our retirement savings actually at the end of that that list and so we forget to put away money for our retirement this way it's automated you pay yourself first you mentioned that there's some tax benefits for a 401k plan yeah definitely there are some tax benefits if you think about the 401k plan it essentially is a tax deferred or let's call it a tax sheltered account so the money you put into this account it grows tax deferred until you retire right but what that means and why that's powerful is that that money that's growing tax deferred is avoiding ongoing taxation thereby allowing your money to compound a lot faster. And essentially, a dollar save is a dollar earned. And your employer can contribute as well. Absolutely. You know, if your employer does offer this matching contribution, it's a wonderful benefit because sometimes it's dollar for dollar. Whatever you put in, they also match it. But keep in mind, you know, not employer, not all employers offer a match. So our recommendation is you check with your HR department to ensure um, if they have a matching provision and what those provisions are. So how much should you put in, Chris? You know, everyone's circumstances is different, but a good rule of thumb, kind of going back to my point about um, matching contributions, if your employer offers a 5% match contribution, for example, you definitely want to at least put in 5% to take advantage of that wonderful employee benefit. But with that said, regardless if your employer offers a match, you definitely want to try and put as much money as you can and you can afford um, into your 401k plan. But the reality is, again, this is money, it's for yourself in retirement. So the more you put in, the earlier you can retire. Yeah, so it sounds like you should just contribute to as much of it as you can, as young as you can. Good stuff. Thank you, Chris. Always a pleasure, Steve. Thanks for having me back. Thank you, and thank you for watching Smart Money Monday.